Welcome to the homework for lesson six. This is module six of second grade. Always remember to write your name here first. It's the easiest question to answer, so get that one out of the way first. And complete each missing part describing each array. Now we're just talking about rows and columns and circling rows, circling columns. It's pretty easy, but when we start talking about three rows of four and four rows of three or four columns of three, it, it can start to get what seems really easy can you can be making mistakes over and over again and have no idea you're making them slow down just be careful and be careful to pay attention to what you're doing it's just a little trickier than you might think it is so you, you really have to pay attention to it as long as you're paying attention the numbers are really easy to work with it's fours and threes and we're not going to have any any arrays that are probably any larger than 20 or so so just take your time and you'll get everything right on the first try and you won't have to go back and fix anything so three rows of how many are in each row circle the rows that's why it says circle the rows because it makes you look at a row so that there's three rows of four in each row three rows of four is 12 and the repeated addition equation here is 4 plus 4 plus 4 is 12. Now over here we're circling columns. Now you'll notice that there's 3 in each column. There's 4 columns of 3. That's 12, so we need 4 3's. 3, 3, 3, 3, still 12. Doesn't it look the same though? It is. Circle rows. That's five rows of three in each row, 15, so that's five threes. Five rows of three, that's five threes. Three, 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 three equals 15. And now we're circling columns. You'll notice it's the exact same array. But now we're looking at the columns. Three columns of one, two, three, four, five in each column. Three columns of five is 15. Since we're counting three columns of five, we have three fives. Five, 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 15. And you start to notice this if you haven't already, and you, you may have noticed it in class. Five rows of three, three columns of five. And if we go up here, we'll look at, and you don't have to highlight these, I just want to show them. Three rows of four, four columns of three. And it equals the same total. Use the array of smiley faces to answer the questions below. So this is a question about rows. So think about it. Just circle a row and look at it. How many rows are there? Well, there's three rows. Of how many in each row? One, two, three, four, five. There's three rows of five. That's 15. We know that from the first page, right? And if we're looking at columns, like that, columns go up and down. How many of those are there? There's one, two, three, four, five. There's five columns, and there's three in each column, and that's 15. So that's five columns of three, and that's that means that there are... So now we have a, an equation with three add-ends. So we can't have five threes there, so we'll have to write three fives. Five, 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 15. Now it says to add one more row. So we're going to have to draw it. Here, I'm going to erase that stuff I drew before just to clean it up. Add another row of smiley faces. All right. One, two, three, four, five. How many smiley faces are there now? Well, we know the original array had 15, so that's 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, or it's another 5, 5, 10, 15, 20. There's 20 smiley faces. Add one more column to this array. All right, so we need another column. 
and each column has four in it. So now there's four more because there's one more column, 24. Use the array of squares to answer the questions below. Well, let's see, how many add-ins do we have here? We have one, two, three, four of them. So we're not saying, we're not looking at the columns because there's only three columns, but there are four rows. And in each row we have three, so we've got four threes. and that's 12 and that's how many rows how many rows are there four and there's three rows that's 12 and if we look at columns that's and you don't have to circle the rows and the columns the way I am I'm just trying to show what I'm talking about and it's the only way I can do it on this video so that's one, if I'm looking at columns, it's one, two, three, right? There's three columns of four in each column, so that's 12. If I remove a row, so I'm just going to cross one out, how many are there now? Well, count it. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, there's nine. Now it says remove a column from what I have left. So there I'm going to remove a column and now this is what I have left I'll outline it in green this is what I have left and you can see that there are six left now